Hello everyone, this is Sharon from East Coast Stories. Welcome to my channel. This video is on Operation Christmas Child Processing Center filler. I know it's very early to start thinking about um, filler for the processing center, but um, you may come across deals. Um, you might just buy enough for your shoeboxes, but I really recommend you or think about um, getting more. If it's a really good deal, um, think about getting more so you can make pencil packs, um, pencil wow packs, or just send as regular filler to the processing center. Um, we're always in need of processing center, processing center filler at the processing centers. Um, some days could be great filler, and some days it can, you know, it would be so-so. Um, it's just availability, really. And for me, the major need are pencil packs. I've come across very awesome pencil packs <laughs> at the processing center, and I'm very, very thankful. But uh, for me, I think every shoebox um, should have some type of some type of school supplies, even the two to fours. Um, across the world, um, international, the average age range for to start school for a child is two to oh, I'm sorry, is four to five years old. So even at um, so that's why I always pack school supplies for um, to two to four range. Um, if a two two year old three year old receives this shoebox they will, you know, eventually grow, <laughs> they will eventually grow and go to school. Okay, so this particular um, pencil pack is, I would consider a wow item, a wow, not a wow item, wow pencil pack. Um, so it's a little bit more um, extra toys, a little bit, um, just little toys, more than just basic school supplies. And I decided to choose um, the two to four range for a girl or boy. It's unisex, and it's a Toy Story slash uh, Ducky themed um, uh, wow packs, pencil packs, and there's a, I've come, um, I started working on this, I would say last year, I know it's quite a while, but I've had some items that I've had for a while, but I didn't think it was enough for a pencil pack, but um, there was an item here that I got, and it just came all together. Okay, so... Here are 18 pencil packs, 18 of the same theme. Almost everything is everything's exactly the same, except some variations of color. Um, so 18, and then I have two more to create. So I have a total of 20 of the same pencil packs for two to four boys, uh, boys or girls. Again, it's, um, it's um, unisex. And again, it's only for a two to four range. Um, if um, the filler is just really low that day and they just need filler, the volunteer could choose to give this to a uh, five and nine if they wish. Um, it, it, it's really up to the processing center. It could be, um, so I, this is just a suggestion really. It's just a suggestion. Okay, um, so here's some the stuff I've created. Um, the pencil packs I've created. I'll start with this. Um, the resealable bag. Um, I got this last year um, thanks to Denise Rogers. She um, she showed a link, um, and I'll post a link below uh, where I got it. It's eight by ten resealable bags. This, I think it's a great size, um, and I use this like um, crack and peel um, sheets. They're like stickers in a way. I got these from work. Um, they were giving it away for free and they said take it home we don't want it anymore um because we're moving we were moving and they were not throwing things but they were just like take whatever you want because we're not taking them um, so i got a whole bunch of that um not a lot um, i'm i probably run out in a couple in a few years okay so what i would do is two to four girl or boy and that's it that's now just cut that up. I decided um, to go ahead and put this the sticker on it, the label, because it was easier to play, to label it when it's flat, already flat. Okay, so I'll put it on top bold very bold orange 
Okay, and then again, I start with the flat items first. I got 10 sheets of wide rolled paper, and this was a deal I got earlier this year. Um, 150 sheets for a quarter, um, a pack of wide rolled paper. So some school supplies. Um, I decided to create a booklet. So again, it's Toy Story Ducky themed. Um, and it's all blank pages. I put, there's nine blank pages here. And then I added the free clip art of a ducky. It's so cute in a little garden, I would say. And Toy Story 4 with Bunny and Ducky. So very cute. And um, I did this last night, um, the clip art and this, the frame of the Toy Story was exactly in the middle. I don't know how I did it. <laughs> don't ask me how. I just did it. It was fantastic. I was really happy, very easy for me to staple. So I invested on a long reach stapler last year. I got it for $15 last year on Amazon and right now I see it's $20. But so look out look out for it. It may go down. Um, so I did I basically eyeballed it. <laughs> And this is the stopper, really. This is a stopper of the middle, of the middle. Okay, so what do I do? I use four staples. Just make sure it's straight, so right on top. Super easy. So my booklet, and then I, what I do is just fold it right in the middle, and that's it. And so a coloring sheet, the front and cover, and just plain pages so this child could draw on their own, or write, whatever they would like. So this is the back. Next, this is uh, mini play packs of Toy Story. Um, so I'll put one for here and the other one. And just to show this mini play pack of, um, so I got, oh, it was eight for $1.26. It was during that whole um, party supply sale from Walmart about like, I would say three weeks ago. So, great. so inside the play packs is just book to color. It's a mini one. It's really a few few pages of Woody, um, Jesse, the horse, um, Buzz Lightyear, you know. And um, so that's it. Um, a sticker of the ducky and bunny. Very, very cute. And then two crayons. I don't think these crayons are sufficient enough, just two. So I'll be adding crayons um, and they're really like they're half the size of a crayon um, but it's still a very cute pack so I put that in the back so now um, I'll add on the bottom a pencil sharpener I got this great deal on Walmart thanks to Jessica for Food Healthy Family. This was a dollar for a 72 count of these great erasers, um, sharpeners. Um, very quality, nice quality sharpeners. So thank you, Jessica. Um, great deal. Um, now they're $20. <laughs> so you may want to look out um, for this um, sharpener set. So a green one. So it was a dollar for 72. So basically it's like a, the sharpener is a dollar and what, five cents? Oh, a dollar. I mean, not a dollar, I'm sorry. <laughs> one penny, 1.5 penny. Um, and then I found um, someone post, some, an OCC member posted on uh, one of the OCC Facebook groups that this was on clearance, oh, on sale on Walmart online for $2.97. So I, I grabbed a few 
or several I would say. Um, 100 erasers for $3.97. Right now I believe they're on sale, so I'll link the link below. This is never at my Walmarts, so even at $5, if it's on that, I would pay for it because it's a great deal. I'll go ahead and grab, oh, let me go ahead and grab a green one. So I'll put that all in the bottom, and this is the back, by the way. I placed this in the back so they could see it's woody on the front, I mean the back. I would say this is the front. So next is this Duplo um, Ducky duck set. Um, I got this from CVS, thanks to Denise from D. Rogers. She alerted us there was an, um, D CVS had their 9% um, off clearance for Easter um, toys. I went to about, this is probably my sixth CVS, and this was hanging, you know, in the aisle, and those hanging um, items, and no one picked it up. I clicked, I got 29 of them. <laughs> so I'll use nine for my shoe boxes and 20 for upper Christmas child. Um, crossing stadium filler and this was originally five dollars or four ninety five and I got it for fifty cents so fantastic deal um, and it's an age range of one and a half plus so that's why I'm putting this in a two to four uh, pencil pack. Wow, pencil pack. oh what I did yeah what I what I did is puncture a little mini hole. I use a th I use a thumbtack, so <laughs> don't use scissors. But since I wasn't prepared, I I'm using scissors to punch a hole and get all the air out. So so try to make as flat as you can. And I try to put all this, the set, mostly to the right middle, um, right middle. And this is where I put the pencils. Um, so I, I'm getting two wood pencils from my Office Depot deal. This, this was 36 per um, for a dollar last year. So that was a good deal. Um, and then this was from the Easter clearance this year from Walmart, tenths, I, 98 cents. I got it for 10 cents. So basically a penny per um, pencil. So I'm packing a total of six pencils. So very basic school supplies for this child. Pencils, paper, eraser, sharpener, and that's it. Okay. And then because of the coloring crayons, I divided a 24 pack of crayons into um, six, these little six packets. Put on right here. I put it right here so look, you could see there's crayons packed in this um, pencil pack. And then next, uh, whistle, I also got on Amazon. Um, I got these 72 in a pack. They were on lightning deal. I grabbed the yellow and the green for these pencil packs. I'll link these below. I thought it was perfect for a two to four range. And then last item, it's a rubber ducky. And this is a paint, paint a painter. Thought it was so cute. It sort of goes somewhat goes with the theme. I mean, it goes with as a rubber ducky, but because it's a painter, so this child could be an artist with all the crayons and to draw the drawing book, the blank drawing book, and that's it. I oh the rubber ducky I got for free. Um, my work had uh, like a little. Um, it's called Ducky Graham. So basically, you they write, we write. Like, thank you for all you do for a particular person, um, or just saying hi. Um, and we do this on a particular day each year. And I got maybe, every year I got maybe 15 each year. And I would give away to my niece and nephews. I've given away to OCC, to my shoeboxes. And right now I'll prop, I have about 50, because 
my coworkers have given them to me, knowing that I've packed shoe boxes. And so I got plenty. <laughs> I have plenty. And it's and I was happy it was free. And they're brand new, never played with, of course. We just use them for decoration, really, just sitting in our shelves. But some were brand new, never even taken on the packaging. So that's it. Well, thank you for watching, and I hope you could create some pencil packs as well, um, pencil well packs, and it could be very basic, you just, because um, I do basic pencil packs as well, you know, just the smaller ones with just pencils, but sharpener, and, uh, you know, eraser, and that's, I'm happy, we're all happy, we're very happy to get anything, really, at the Prossy Center. Okay, well, thank you for watching, and stay safe.